is my scooter that I received from my grandmother on my cousin's side. It's a 49cc Sun L gasoline scooter. It has the GS Moon 46, I mean 49cc engine, complete with exhaust pipe. <clears throat> it's turn signals, tail lights, huffy seat. <clears throat> It's got one mirror, the other mirror was tore off. Okay, it's got the gauge cluster, it's got the battery sensor, the speed. Okay, the only thing that it needs on it is the pull start, which is right there, and a battery that is under there. Okay, it's got a half a tank of gas in it crunk it one time. I had to fill out, figure out the wiring diagram on it though. The orange and the yellow is to turn on the power to the scooter. And the green and the black and white wire is the kill switch. The throttle's good. But this brake right here is messed up on it. I'm about to repair that. It's got headlight in the center and turn signals that work. The tires are fairly new. Front. Rear. It was it was belonged to a nephew. He rode it a couple of times and just left it out in the weather. As you can see, it's got little pitting, pittings on the paint sap on the other part of the body which I can't get off and rust on the seat post and a little rust on the other side on the handlebar post right here now I got to get a boat to go through here to tighten on the other side so that part right there won't wiggle okay the front brakes is locked up a little bit I can match the brake, brake pedal on the other side or Level on the other side and it won't move, so I'm about to take that apart and clean it. Okay, I tried to crank it, it crunked and run just a little bit, but I think I know what the problem is on it. I put a little, a little starting fluid in the carburetor, it crunked up and ran for about two or three seconds and then stopped. This is the problem on these scooters. That little black line right there in the back, right there. Out the head rotor, he let it sock and it had gas in the line and it um, clogged up that little jet in there. So I'm going to take that carburetor loose and clean it out real good with some parts cleaner or carburetor cleaner. And I'm going to put it back together and <clears throat> when I get my started, shoot it fire right up. <clears throat> I'm going to have to uh, fix that part right there. I guess that's where he dropped it at and it deformed it, broke it. So I'm going to get my file and just file it down and make it smooth and do the other side the same way so it'll match. Okay. And I think the maximum speed on these right here, I don't know how much horsepower that GS Moon engine has, but um, I think the speed is 30, 35 miles per hour. Oh yeah, and the chain has been sitting outside so long that the chain is rusted a little bit. So I know how to do that. I take that off and soak it in some some oil, loosen it up. Get some fine grit sandpaper and sand that chrome back. It, it should come back out because that right there, look at that. That right there was rusted just like that. And I just scraped it with something and it came out pretty good. But I'm getting some fine grit sandpaper and sand it and smooth it out. Now, as far as that little suitcase that goes back there, I don't know if I'm gonna put that back on there or not. I might. I might put me a little CD player in there and put me two speakers on, on the back somewhere. Uh, but that's it for now, my 49cc Sun L gasoline scooter 
with a GS Moon 46cc engine. All right, talk to y'all later.